So away to owners, and welcome to Land and Sea section 8, this one the third part of the section on Hannibal. From there, the column began to advance. Um, from there being, this is following directly on from section 7, so Hannibal is pointing out to the soldiers, oh look, down there, that's going to be easy, we're, we're climbing over the walls of Italy, and um, yeah. Now, with the enemy, not even, ne quidem, not even, trying nothing. Uh, so this is obviously a double negative, it's just there to emphasize. This here being an ablative absolute, we have an ablative noun followed by an ablative participle. Beyond small raids, furtive things, on occasion, per cogianum is the easiest way to translate that. Literally means something like through. Um, like, every so often, in the sense of. However, Keterum, the journey was by far more difficult. Uh, difficilius is a comparative adjective. It's actually neuter. Um, the, the sentence is obviously quite broken up. You just have to deal with that. Than it had been on the ascent, or in the ascent. We have another one of these clauses where it's just as much as this, in that same way this. Um, so here it's for as much or just as much as most brackets of the slopes of the Alps, literally from Italy, so on the Italian side, sunt are shorter, just as much or just so, eater, they are steeper. Um, so this is obviously saying... You know, uh, Hannibal had been saying to his troops, okay, we're nearly there, we're all going downhill now. And it's like, yes, the slopes are, are, are shorter, but that just means they're steeper, because you've still got to go the same height. For nearly the all the way, for nearly the whole way, was steep and narrow and slippery, so that they were not able, they were not able there, uh, possent, to keep themselves from literally a fall, so from slipping. Uh, this is a result clause. The, the path is so slippy that they couldn't keep themselves from falling, nor brackets could, so we're still using the possent from the previous section, those who had fallen or had slipped a little, how them, they were not able to keep them, uh, to cling on to harare, having been thrown, um, so ad flicti is a perfect passive participle, having been thrown from their suo trail, or perhaps here footing, and some fell down upon others, and beasts onto men. That is to say, as they're going down the path, people just keep sliding and slipping in the snow, and they keep falling over onto each other, and it's not a fun situation. Um, a little bit of visualisation for this. Um, obviously, we don't know exactly where we talked about this last time. Um, but the Alps in winter, depending on where you're going, um, you can imagine that trying to do this without a nice cleared road, and, you know, the sort of more general trail, um, or down here, that would not be fun, particularly with elephants, um, perhaps. So this is the view of Mont Blanc from the Petit Sinan. Petit Saint Bernard route, which is one of the ones that they may have gone. Obviously, they wouldn't be climbing over that, but perhaps climbing over this with elephants and not really sure where they're going. That would not be a fun situation. Um, and that is it. It's a relatively short and simple section. I hope that makes sense. Thank you very much.